guys, it's Laura from Mad Mimi's Crochet and Farming. And today is Thursday, which is Tile of the Week Thursday. That's as much singing as I'm going to do. So, um, Tile of the Week Thursday. What is Tile of the Week Thursday? Well, my friend, Sam, and her partner, Mike, um, from... Mampha's Makes Sam received this book in Happy Mail. And she vowed for all to hear that she was going to do one a week until the book was completed. <laughs> well, I kind of felt sorry for her. So, um, I joined in. I joined in around week 16. Yeah, I started on week 16. So, I still have a I have done a few of the back ones, but I still have um, to catch up. Um, but I have done all of the ones since. And we are on tile number 53 right now. And it is called Popcorn Fantasy. And let's see. This is what it's supposed to look like. Isn't that pretty? I mean, those colors are right up my alley. Alrighty. Well, now you'd think I would use colors similar. Well, kind of. I used one similar. Can you guess what it is? I get you, you know, uh, your first guess is probably wrong. So, I used only one color for this one. And um, I will be retiring the rest of this to my uh, scrap rug. Um, I used Lily Sugar and Cream in the color Dazzle Blue. It's uh, 2.5 ounces, uh, approximately 120 yards. And it's 100% cotton. Um, and there it is. So this is what I had left. And uh, blue is always a, a good color to put in a scrap rug. So I probably could do the middle of a tile, you know, somewhere around. But I'm actually going to keep this and just use it for the scrap rug. If somebody might notice that Persephone is right here. Persephone is on timeout. <laughs> anyway, um, so let's see what the tile is going to, or ended up looking like. I used a four and a half millimeter Clover Amour hook. And here is my tile. I do like the one that they did better, um, but... I, I, you know, I honestly wasn't in the mood to sew in hundreds of ends. So, I decided that two ends were enough to sew in, and uh, so that's what I did. I think it came out great, and uh, somebody will love to get this um, washcloth. It's got kind of, it's got nubbies on it. Yeah, nubbies are always fun. Okay, so this is, uh, where did you go, Persnickers? I don't want to run over you. Um, why is she on a timeout? Well, we have a live vole running through the madhouse. Um, and she doesn't care. So she is stuck inside until she catches the treat that she brought for me. So, that's that. <laughs> Okay, so that was tile number 53. Let's find out what <laughs> tile number 54 is going to be. Um, the designer for this one that we just did was jo Johanna or jo jo Joanna, Joanna, Johanna, Johanna, however, uh, Lindahl. Uh, this another one, this new one, 
Oh, me, oh, my. It is a design by my friend Katie Moore. Um, she's calling for six colors. Um, it's called Fraser. Now, I went to school with a guy named Fraser. And if you add an A onto that, Frasera, Frasera, um, I'm not sure how she is. Yeah. It has 17 ends. Um, 17 rounds. And this is what it's supposed to look like. There we go. So she doesn't really use bright and cheerful colors. She just uses normally some blah stuffs. So there are, um, wow, there's popcorn stitches. Not very many. The middle has a lot of popcorn. Well, yeah, I guess there are quite a few. Um, it's just that the colors that she used, they're kind of hard to tell. So there's, um, a five double crochet popcorn, a four double crochet popcorn, and a uh, Pico's. I think I only see like four Pico's. But there are quite a few popcorns, but not like this one, the one we just did. So, huh, I really hope she catches that vole soon. All right. I don't know where she went. Oh, she's looking out the window down there. Okay, so um, that is it. And um, I'm looking forward to making this next one. I uh, am looking for more forward to Persephone catching this vole that is running around here. I just saw it a couple of minutes ago and she could care less. Um, so I've got to make sure that... Um, She's looking in the right direction next time I see it. Try to run across my feet. They're not scary or anything. I just, you know, when you're not expecting to see it, that's all right. So, um, thanks, guys, for watching. Thanks to all of my new subscribers, um, all of my uh, subscribers that have been here throughout the years <coughs> watching me do really strange things. And, um... And for watching Persephone do strange things with me. And for laughing along with me when I have voles loose in um, the, uh, the madhouse. And if you're not sure what a vole is, it's like a little teeny tiny mouse. Um, and sometimes she lets shrews in too. Um, but it was my fault. My fault. Totally my fault. I left the door open. But that is okay. So... Um, thanks guys for watching. Um, you guys have a great day and, um, I'll talk to you next time. Prayers that she catches it would be wonderful too. Cro fingers crossed, toes crossed. Mm -hmm. Yep. All right, guys. Bye-bye.